We're going to Chernobyl exclusion zone. And this time we're not messing around. We're going to infiltrate the fourth NPP unit through the secret tunnel. Right, the one which exploded. There are lots of corridors and the NPP is guarded well. Can we make it safe and undetected? You will know it yourself soon. Oh my gosh, he dived in the water! Oh my gosh, no! Well guys, here we go again. We're back to Pripyat. Look who is going with us. Hello friends, you may remember me. I was helping with the flat repair in Pripyat. Though I have changed a little, I've got beard and so on. Glad to see you. And we have found this guy. Hello, dear friends. Yeah, last year I couldn't go with you, but this time I'm here. We will force our way to Pripyat together and break the law of Illinois state. And other stalkers have already told us that there are lots of photos of Super Sus and Kreasan on every corner in Pripyat now. Let's go quietly, guys. It is Quas, not be your guys. I see you've got a teddy bear with you. Why? This is my family talisman. It reminds me about my family in the hardest moments of my life. When it's bad weather, dangers and other emotions, I always remember about them. Alex is lying, we're in Russia, Taiga. Going to the Dyatlov Pass, right? Yeah. It looks like that. Oh my gosh, so big. It is macro the pot here, won't eat it? It is overripe, not a tasty. It's fly, Garrick. No, it's not. Look at it, guys. Is it a fly, Garrick? I think it's macro the peyote, guys. It is a fly, Garrick. I know about them everything. I've been working with mushrooms for 40 years. People say if you eat one cap of fly, Garrick, you're gonna feel painkiller effect. And if you eat two, you will have hallucinations, yeah. We have to be quiet now, there may be cameras here. And camera traps. I thought only us installed them. Have you heard that people have seen bears in Pripyat? Yeah. The main thing is not to be caught. Hush everyone, we are close to the barb fans. Super Sus is taking photos for Instagram. There is no entrance. Dima, search for it, please. We can climb on it, in a stalker way, you know. Police works well, they have fixed all the fans. Oh my gosh, Sus is going already. Oh my gosh. See if anyone's there. Quietly. Now we have to get out of here nice and easy. They may be waiting for us here. That's it guys, we are in the zone. These pines are pictures. Cool. Hey Dima, are we lost? Why staying? I wanna take off my jacket. I'm going to Pripyat too. Your uncle Valera? He's Bear Caballero. Lots of abandoned vehicles in the forest. It is all around. That is a special liquidator's vehicle storage area. It is called Buryakovka. There was a village once. It was called Buryakovka. All these vehicles are very radioactive. So they have left them here. There are so many tires here. Oh my gosh. Look here, guys. Don't touch it, it may be radioactive. No, I know, this one is okay, I'm sure about it. Though we don't have a dosimeter with us. Check out this tractor condition. Let's go to the cabin. I don't want to fall. We're going to restore this one, yeah. But there is no place to sit now. That is a hell, guys. Well, someone has taken it apart before us. Can we restore it now? That would be hard, almost impossible. There is no engine now. Stolen. Yeah, nothing we can do. We can't even turn it. It is rusty. There is some English here. Motor. We can't use it, right? Yeah, no use of it. There it is, guys. Everything here is disassembled and ruined, guys. But we will find something good enough to be restored, I'm sure. There's an ancient house. Where? Let's look at it. Let's see. Maybe that's from vehicles too. There are some combines, bodies. 
There is some heating here, looks like a change house. Why is iron stolen? Careful with the floor. A heater in a change house, what is going on here? They lead lots of people, so many change houses here. Oh my gosh, guys. What was it for? I don't know, some change houses. The heating system is good. There must be a boiler room somewhere. Maybe they were doing something with vehicles, and that's for workers. There's another tractor over here. It was torn to pieces, even this axle. Isn't that a U.S. the loaf or something? There is a cross here. That's a hell, guys. This forest is filled with abandoned vehicles. There was a generator here. It was about 30 kilowatts, or even more. There is its rotor. What is that? There are some wheels inside. Oh my gosh, look what's there. Is it a washing machine vehicle or something? I've never seen it before. It is a fire truck which is taking the reactor. Do you realize what fools are we? It is so dangerous here. Guys, we don't even have a dosimeter with us. We stand near the thing and don't even know why there is a hole like this. <laughs> Donetsk 85. There are vehicles from all USSR. That is not surprising. It's only 5 minutes till patrol arrival. We have to get moving. Do you know what is that, Max? That is a military engineering machine for cleaning. Just look at this powerful thing. They cleared the path in prepaid with this. The radiation must be crazy here. Yeah, we better get moving from here. The bad thing, we don't know the radiation rate. Why is that thing here? Were the people sitting? I don't know. The windows were armored. Look here. Look at this bucket, guys. It must be very radioactive, guys. So sorry. But we have to film it fast and run away. Such a pity we forgot the dosimeter. How could we? We are so sorry, guys. So the liquidators have removed the nuclear fuel with this. And there is a Burikovka over there. Unfortunately, we can't enter it. Now there are cameras everywhere. So there are planes and helicopters, right? Yeah, here they are. Look. It is heavily guarded now. Do you hear a car coming here? We have to get out of here ASAP. They are after us. This area is guarded well now because they have brought some new containers with radioactive waste from Europe. When we were coming closer, I've seen military with dogs. We hid in the bushes right away. And hasn't filmed that. Sorry, guys. Let's move, guys. Get out. We have heard dogs barking. Was it a patrol, Dima? Sure thing it is. And they are returning. Let's go. Run, guys. The radiation in the most of the forest is normal, guys. It has recovered. But Ukrainian government doesn't want to open this area and remove restrictions. And we're gonna show you why. So, Max, is it a nuclear waste storage for Americans here? The USA has built it for themselves. Just imagine what we found, guys. We have found a real American nuclear waste storage in Chernobyl. The worst thing in that is that many hectares of Earth will die. This waste station will destroy the ecology. That is the ventilation shaft over here. Check it out, guys. America is bad. This area will be guarded well, but it doesn't work yet. That is why we can walk around. There will be a great moat with water. We will not pass here. So this area will be surrounded with water barrier. I don't get what for. So Chernobyl is going to be a restricted area because soon American nuclear waste will poison the groundwater. And it will not hurt anyone, cities and people. I think it's gonna poison the soil. Maybe they will pump it back if it happens. There is a well on that purpose, I think. The government have built a railroad with the only purpose to transport the liquid nuclear waste easily. What kind of business is that? How much did they restore? They have repaired the railroad to Yanov station completely and also wanted to make it to Vilchin, but that isn't clear. Can Americans really pour cars of nuclear waste here? We have no official statement. We have found another tractor here. Looks like it was broken and left here. Some extra parts here, guys. There is some rusty thing. Oh my gosh, what is that? How anyone can restore it, guys? I don't know. Look, there are some tools here. 
a hammer, maybe someone has been repairing it. It looks like an air filter. How does it even work? Many tubes here. And how do people clean it? Write us some comments about it, guys. This one isn't going to be repaired soon. There are a few tracks missing. They are so huge. It might have enormous power inside. There was some welding, but why doing that? Maybe it was torn off. Its paint is new. Its condition is cool, by the way. It is restorable. This one is a way better than one near Pripyat city, isn't it? Yeah. Let's go. There is some dashboard, but we should start it from the outside. There are pedals, levers, brakes and so on. What about the indicators, Alex? Is everything alright? I think it's all rusty. Yeah, no good. I have climbed up to film this nuclear waste factory better. There you can see some watchtowers. For guarding this area, the second one and another one. Four, five, six, seven, eight. There are eight of them. It is guarded heavily. There are patrols time to time. So we better get out of here, not to be caught. We're going to go to the fifth power unit. Right inside of the place where was supposed to be the reactor itself. The reactor room. And we will have to dive, the way is flooded. Don't worry, we've got super suits. There is plenty of security here. Wait, I think it is a crane, which can lift up to 700 tons. Yeah, you're right. Guys, this crane can lift the nuclear reactor. We're gonna go there. There is a factory nearby where this reactor was assembled. Out of three giant parts. And then it had to be used in the nuclear power plant. Yeah, let's go and see it. And there is the fifth unit. Oh my gosh, Super Suze is already waiting us here. And then we will go into the nuclear waste storage. Oh my gosh. That's risky. We're going in the storage. We have taken chemical protection suits. We're gonna use them. Have you got gas masks too? Yeah, I've got everything, even gloves. We're gonna be protected well. Super. Awesome, don't worry Alex, we'll be safe. Such a beautiful tractor. I guess someone uses it. Look over there, there are locks, it is closed. It is building guarded. There are some abandoned cars over there. I wonder, why does the tractor look brand new? It is just well groomed. And the trailer as well. Look at it, so big. Oh my gosh, guys. A starter. We have to pull it to start the engine. Really? Yeah, just like a chainsaw. How can we get in the cabin? From the other side. Let's go and try. Oh my gosh, look how it's connected. Looks unreliable. Look. Come on. Wow. Whoa. Get in, Max. Oh, I see you've never known about it. No tractor in Pripyat starts with a key. It doesn't need it. I'm not sure how to go. It is the left and the right track. Uh huh. So I turn it like this. Yeah. It has no wheels, but tracks. I feel like in a tank. It is all ruined. It is okay. That is Chernobyl. So that is the accelerator and that's a brake, right? Yeah. That is a wheel. What is that for? Guys, write us what is that. One, two, three. So that is accelerator, clutch and brake. Look here, the thing is broken. So we can't raise a bucket. Have you seen that? Let me close it. I know how to do it. That's it. Ready. These tracks are almost new. Wait. They are well attached. Let's go to the assembly factory. Yeah, let's go. It's about 5 p.m., guys. Sus is walking over there. Oh, look, they're getting metal from here. Yeah, obviously. So we're going there, aren't we? Look at it, guys, the generator. It shows the voltage one day. What is this canister for? Can we launch it, Alex? No, there is no engine. There was someone walking. Well, guys, this is the very place where had to be assembled the fifth nuclear reactor. And this roof was supposed to shift. There are the rails. 
the roof moved and the crane was moving the reactor which had to be there. It was supposed to stand over there, on the spillers, and then had to be moved in the nuclear power plant. Hey Max, let me show you what was the reactor, let's go. I read about it. Do you see these concrete pillars around? Here and there, all around. An enormous reactor was standing on them. It was so huge and round, just fancy that. Do you know why there is sand? I know, they were doing some sandblasting. Yeah, right. And after the reactor was taken from here, there came the marauders. They cut metal parts and then sandblast them. Sandblasting cleans metal from radiation. It removes the radioactive particles. Sandblasting is sand mixed with air under high pressure. Yeah. By the way, the marauders sold metal to factories. So maybe you have something at your house, which was made from metal, was lying here one day. Let's think about the sand. There is plenty of it. The marauders were sandblasting, weren't they? Yeah, and they removed the particles. So there is radiation right here. PT, we don't have a dosimeter. Despite we are working on it, I hope we will stay alive to this. <laughs> About 20 years, not more. Really? You have 25 more years to live. No, I can't agree, I'm too young. If you've been to Pripyat, you will not live longer than 50. Those marauders have left here lots of metal around. They've been working here until they argued with Chernobyl management. And now they can't get metal from here legally anymore. And they can't sell it to anyone. So there is still plenty of it in Chernobyl. There is another weird solid part. It looks scary. What was it for? I can't imagine. Yeah, I think you're gonna open it now. There may be something radioactive inside. It is screwed tight up there. We can't open it anyway. Look at this giant thing nearby. What was it for? What kind of cylinder is that? That's a hell, guys. So many weird things here. There is a sandblast machine. Yeah, it is. They've made such a mess here with it. Are we going to dive today? Yeah, let's go. I feel like I want to swim. Yeah, guys, soon we are going to dive in the radioactive waste storage. Oh my gosh, look here. Someone has been there and they have taken a bite. How big is that? Imagine, this crane can lift a 700 tons reactor. Do you think so? Yeah, it is the maximum weight. Actually, it wasn't used. The fourth power unit blew up and they stopped the process. Keep away from these cables. Why? Are they radioactive? Yeah, very much. Oh my gosh. Let's get out of here. Well, guys, we have found a nice flat in the nuclear power plant. There are beds here. Look what we've got here. Some food. We're gonna eat. Yummy. Plenty of chocolate bars here. But that is the best yummy for Sus. Let him teach us how to do it. We don't need a knife. Why? It's gonna blow up. There it goes. He's so hungry. Wait, what about the skin? You don't want to peel that? Is it taste here? Well, guys, we have made it to the nuclear power plant. Now we need a little bit of rest and test chemical protection suits. And then we're going to reach the fourth reactor unit, which exploded through a secret fluid tunnel of the Chernobyl nuclear power plant. We're going to the fifth power unit. It was under construction, it's over there. And Super Seuss wanna swim. In theory, we can get to the fourth unit through those fluid tunnels. And Super Seuss has special suits. We wonder if we can infiltrate the most secret places no one has ever been. Let's go. Let's take a look at this crane. Oh my gosh. Look at it, Max. Oh my, it's huge. Look at its wheels. There's a plate. What's there, Sus? Is there a pass? I heard that there was a pipeline. Can we pass there? There is some water. Is it too much? Not really. Shall we go there or anywhere else? Let's check those hard doors. Let's go. Let's take this stair with us. It's so long. Oh my gosh. Are we gonna go there? 
Просто посмотрите. Сейчас, look at it, guys. Oh my gosh. That's a hell. Is it okay? It is bent so much. I don't care. I'm not afraid. I'm scared already. See? This ain't easy. It's bad, I see. It's all shaking, dude. I'm really afraid. It's vibrating so hard. After this trip, Alex, you won't be afraid of anything. Watch your head. Yeah, yeah. There's a robot, guys. Show me. There's a Soviet robot. Look at these springs. Oh my gosh. Guys, that is mad. Sus, what are you doing? It's darkness below. It's about 15 meters, guys. Let's go, Alex. Slowly, go there. We're going. They're shaking hard. What is that? Oh my gosh, it's so cool. There was a giant watertight door, and it was stolen. I'm tall, and it is just two meters here, guys. Look. Yeah, very unusual. There are many hatches. It is very high to fall through them. What was this room for? Weird. Watch where you're going. Too many hatches there. And there is pretty much of steel around. Oh my gosh, it was cut off by someone. Looks like a bank vault. Someone came here, closed the door and called the other side. And they let him in. Some kind of airlock. That looks scary, guys. What for was this room? I wonder. And why calling? Yeah, there's a phone up there. What was the guarding here? Let's go and see. There's a chain here. I can't imagine how heavy was this door. That looks weird. It took them a really long time to cut it off. And that five tones door smashed loudly then. Anyway, this door was stolen and the phone too. There's a bulb here. What is that? What do you mean? There's a second door lying here. So they haven't stolen the second door. And there are four bearings here around this doorway. What do you think they kept here behind this heavy door, guys? Money? Do you think money? Yeah, cash. All cash of USSR. Yeah, maybe. But what really was there? What is that? Can I go there? Look at these awesome bearings. Oh my gosh. It is round. What is this staff protection for? We don't know. I wish we knew. It is very roomy here. Oh my gosh, there are so many hatches. We gotta be extremely careful. Let's go down. Yeah. Is there another stair? It's really hot here. I guess some nuclear fuse is composing somewhere. I don't know. It is very hot here, guys. Too much. But it's winter now. What's going on? Oh, it's shaking. What is that? It's a giant pipe. Oh my gosh, there's nothing below again. Oh my, look what we found. Holy, there's a little swamp here, guys. Just look at it. Look at the stair, Max. Do you want to go up? Maybe. No, 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 it's broken. There is so much of waste concrete. Let's go inside. I want to swim. Oh my gosh, we're in the basement now. Max, do you like in here? Anton would say it's futuristic here. We don't get what happened, but everything here is ruined. There are plenty of carcasses, but nothing seems to fall here. So much of waste. Oh my! Sus has opened that hard door. He has found a way. So many doors here. 
Lots of disassembled panel boards. Is there anything valuable? Maybe some copper? Wow, this looks cool. It is all ruined here, guys. Like a doomsday. I found some current transformers. Weird, they aren't disassembled. There must be some copper inside. It's so dangerous to walk here, we may fall. I found some money. What do you mean? How much? Look at the thing. Oh my gosh, why didn't they take it? Maybe it's too hard to break it. There's a metal inside, it's like a rock. Such a nice piece of copper. Why they didn't take it? Just look at the size. This door has some lubrication still. Nice quality. That's a hell, guys. Where am I going? And where we are going now? So that's how we're looking for trouble here. We don't know where we are going. This room is endless, guys. There are giant pipes and vast rooms. Just imagine how much energy they consumed. Yeah, very much. I have never seen it in my life. What is there, Suze? Look here. Oh my gosh! The electric boxes. But why there are so many? Look here, guys. My flashlight can't even reach the end of this room. This corridor is so long. A scratch an emblem everywhere, a lighting, which means high voltage. Just imagine how much copper there was. Oh, a socket. Add 220 volts, guys. Transformer, junction box, K60. This wasn't finished, guys. This transformer room is just endless. All the insides are taken apart and stolen. Just look at it. That futuristic cylinder again. It's oxygen. Entry is prohibited. Are we gonna stop here? No. Look at this. These bolts and hinges are just enormous. We better not to touch them. They are radioactive. Oh my god, this door is so thick. Is it full metal? Yeah. So it really could stand a nuclear explosion then. 2150 kilograms, one door. Holy moly, it's 1982. I don't believe it weighs so much. I thought it was 800 kilograms, or maybe one ton, but it is two tons and a half. There are drawn some hints not to get lost. But I think we are lost already. Just smell the radiation and follow it. Follow the radiation way. If you try it, you will not be able to live without radiation. You're gonna search for the most contaminated places. I hope we will not be lost with our guy Supersus. Hey Dima, where are we going now? I don't know, I'm new here, just hired. I need to learn the map and so on. Show us your working outfit. There it is. Look at it, guys. Novarka, the Chernobyl reactor. This NPP has dozens of rooms. It's a giant building. These rooms make a labyrinth. We are in the real labyrinth. We never know where we are going. Oh my gosh. It's so roomy here. We better get out of this place. It's so radioactive here. They melt copy here. It's so black. Faster, faster. Let's go. It is radioactive. Oh my gosh, we have found something. But what is that? Guys, what is this? So there must be steam turbine somewhere up. Turbine hole for the third power unit. Number 10. Where are you going? Guys, I'm thinking I'm gonna... It's a generator. No, Alex, I'm teleporting to somewhere. I can feel it. This generator is really big. I have no words. Is it from a turbine? Yeah, I think so. Some parts from turbines here. And they didn't take copper for some reason. Oh my gosh! Can we go there? Oh, that's a bad idea. These pipes are for reactor cooling. They're enormous. Holy moly! And all of them are cut for some reason. Do you know what is that, Max? I have no idea. It's a drum separator. It separates steam from water. Do you like the hole? Oh my gosh, what a hole! Oh my god, it's fluted here. There are so many of them. Is it only 30 meters? Do you mean to the reactor? Yeah, we are close. Look at these pipes below. The holes. It's grand, such power. Just look at it, guys. Here we are. There is a cross. And the nuclear reactor was supposed to stay here. 
We should move carefully. There was some stainless steel here. It all was taken away. So be wary. This looks like cooling system. And these panels are heat insulation. So there was a nuclear reactor right in the middle. I mean, it was supposed to stand here, but it was never installed. Holy Chernobyl, I almost fell down. And look up there. It is really high. I think it's nine floors high or something. There was a bat. Nice echo, isn't it? The real nuclear reactor is really something, guys. We have found a new reducer. And Zeus is going to spin it. Look here. It is moving really slowly. But how much time is gonna take? Oh, there's another wall door. Two of them. Can we go there? There's a well-preserved office over here. Maybe stalkers live there. There's a tablet. Let's see what's in there. What? A tablet? What is there? It's a seat. Oh, really? A tablet from 1987. Nice joke, Max. There are some bottles. Maybe there is some alcohol. Was it vodka or milk? That is kefir or milk. There is a label here. Let's see, is that Ukrainian? That's from Lugansk. But what is that? It's mineral water, Alex. Aha, uh -huh, it's like a key number 4. Kiev factory. Look at that. Oh my, it's little 24. I really like its smell, it's very cool. That is for bunkers and military vehicles. This smells awesome. Better than Chanel. Let's go. Are you going? Is it waste from cables? Yeah, cable shells. Zeus, where are you going? Is it the secret tunnel to the force unit? Are we going? It beats me. Let's go, maybe. Guys, we are going to infiltrate the force power unit. The one which exploded. From this fifth one. We have just been in. We are close. Yeah, it's cable collector. Maybe it's the right way. We can go there easily. There is soft floor here, Max. Sure, I think it was damaged with radiation. Some people dream of warm floor, but we've got soft. What is that? There's another one. Oh, another pass here. It is right behind this wall. It isn't that long, by the way. Maybe we're close. I think we're gonna find it today. We aren't here yet. What is that? That is a riddle. What? Some letters. And there's another one. Yeah. The tunnel goes farther. Oh my gosh. There is water here. We're gonna use the suits. Alex, the tunnel isn't over yet. I never knew that there are catacombs here. Marit is getting flooded here. What is there? I don't know. What is this pipe? It's parallel here. It is blocked. Oh my gosh. Oh no. This wall is new. Yeah, it prevents anyone going to the force power unit. Right, if we should break this wall. Maybe Zeus can do it. Come on, Zeus. We have to find a bypass. The neighbor tunnel is blocked as well. There's another tunnel on the left. What is that? An alphabet? Yeah, kids learn some there. What the hell? Yeah, builders grew new generations of builders while working. And taught them alphabet. Right in these tunnels. We have found one tunnel, but it's flooded. We have to go, we have no other options. Well, we've got Alex, the dungeon expert. No one saying except him will ever climb in such hole. We've got protection suits. We will try to dive through. There's a room up ahead. And in theory, we can get inside of the fourth power unit. Through this corridor. We'll try to see what is there at least. We don't have a diving suit, but I've got a gas mask and suits. So we won't be frozen there. And there's a powerful lantern. There we go. At least we will know what is there. Let's go. Guys, do you like our idea? Gas mask instead of a scuba. Oh my gosh, do you really want to dive there? I can see the pass. Hey, are you gonna go already? What about the suit? Let's see. Oh my gosh. There's another floor under us. Look, a fluted floor. What a hell. So much of water here. That's a hell. 
Can you really dive there? That is too hard, Zeus. That's gonna be fun. That floor is flooded. Max, it is flooded up to the ceiling. I see. Are you gonna dive if there is a pass, Max? Yes, yes, and you? I've got no choice. I can't stop thinking about cold water, you know? What if too much water will get inside of the suit? And I will not get out. Do people use the suits for diving? If we do it right, we can. Will water get inside at all? Sure thing. But how are you gonna dry yourself? I'm going to undress and put on the suit. Oh my gosh. No one has ever done that in the zone, guys. This city needs a new hero. Yeah, yeah. Are you scared at all? Sure thing I'm scared. You may get some radiation. I'm afraid not to get out of there. Well, guys, we're gonna put there a camera. Water is really cold, Sus. There is something moving underwater. What? What is that? That is a mutant. Yeah, it's Chernobyl, it's okay. Super Seuss is almost ready. I really naked Super Seuss? Sure. That's hard. What about underwear? Are you putting the mask on? Hey Max, are you going there? I don't know. I'm not going. Are you cold? Not yet. We've got much of rubber today. Check it out guys, filming on iPhone. Do you like the quality? Let's switch to Sony. That's it. It's Sony. And iPhone now. Write below what image you like the most guys. Sony or iPhone? Just tell me. It's 11 Pro and Sony FDR 3000. Just for you to know. Three cameras and one big one. Sus looks different already. Is he gonna get wet now? I think so. He isn't protected from water at all. Let's tie the thing, right? What are you doing? And this is connected now. Wow. Cool. Hush. That was just water dripping. There may be security checking here. No way. In the basement too. Not in the basement, but close. Anyone can hear as well from here. Oh my gosh. Just don't cry too loudly. Yeah, we gotta speak low voice. We are showing off too much. I start worrying for you, Sus. Why? What if you're gonna feel unwell there? And what? Do you wanna give him a rescue breathing? If I have to. Don't you want him to die? He could kill me for hype. <laughs> Do you remember that video when Deus filled the room with nitrogen? Yeah, and they died for hype. That was stupid. That is it, guys. Wish me luck. Remember me a good man. How's water? I see. Does it get inside of his suit? Not yet. Till I'm half in water. What is over there, Sus? Some tunnels. Is there a turn to the right? Yeah. Is it far? There's a bunch of tunnels in all directions. Oh my gosh. Give me a camera, I can film that. Well, friends, I'm gonna go there first. Damn, I've mudded water. Just move slowly. There's another intact wall door. Well, it's okay here so far. Some corridors. Oh my. What is there? The tunnel split. It is minus 3 Celsius here. There are more doors here. Oh my gosh. Maybe that was an accounting office. What we've got here? Another intact wall door. There are some rooms, maybe for keeping organs. We are searching for the tunnel to reach the fourth power unit. To can't know where it is. It is a secret. There are doors, tunnels and so on everywhere. And radioactive water. What am I doing for YouTube, guys? That is minus 3 Celsius. And it's gonna be minus 6 down there. And minus 9 and so on. So there are even more floors below us. Oh, it's you. Where are the stairs to? No, but there are lots of corridors, five directions. Here and there, I didn't go farther. But this gas mask won't protect you from water, Sus. It's not insulated. That's a hell, guys. Hard. So what, Sus? Cold? Yeah. Do you see anything? Nothing at all. 
Oh my gosh, guys, he's doing that. That's a hell. What's up? Sus, are you okay? Is it water? Hey, Sus. That was a bad idea. About the gas mask. I was choking. What the hell? That was hard. Guys, don't ever try this, please. You've seen what happened. Don't even try to swim in the gas mask. He's diving, guys. Oh no. I don't see anything. It's too muddy. That's a hell, guys. Zeus is swimming. Water is ice cold. We need a scuba gear. Yeah, right. I didn't see anything. Water is too dirty. How many floors are below? Two floors at least. Is there a way to the power unit? That remains unknown. Oh my gosh. What is that, Sus? So you are all wet. That suit didn't help at all. It is warmer in it. Boots are heavy, about 10 kilograms each. Do you mean 10 liters of water? Oh my gosh. It is your turn, Max. Nope, I'm not going there. No. I could drown there. Guys, he was wearing socks. In the radioactive basement. Oh my gosh. What the hell is that? Alright guys, we have to get moving. Because we are going to find another tunnel to the fourth power unit. There is a secret pass, which was flooded. We left the fifth power unit. There it is. And there is a fourth power unit. Behind that crane over there. Well, let's get moving, or we're gonna be caught. I don't remember the way. Here or there? There. A railroad? Really? Look at it. Was that for the crane? We heard some noise in the building. Maybe that was police. And now we're getting out of here. In case that was security. That can be very dangerous, guys. Oh, I can hear a train going. A train? And what are these ruins? I think that used to be a bridge. No, that was a building once. Well, it looks like no one there now. We just heard a noise resemble a train. Heard that? Hush. They're over there. Look. The security. Oh my gosh, film them. Use iPhone. Come on. The left. Good thing they didn't see us. We were almost busted. We can hear them now. Damn it, that's hard. That is unexpected. Max is filming them. I wouldn't take a risk. They just didn't see us. We were talking full voice. And then we saw them walking along over there. Two men, armed. Are them from Walker? They ought to be. That was the armed security of the zone. How didn't they see us? We were talking normally. And then Sue said, Guys, I see two guardsmen in front of us. They didn't see us. They were like walking nice and easy. And didn't expect anyone hiding there. There's a road. Yeah, they were going right there. Yeah, we gotta move fast, so that no one catches. us. They were walking here just yet. And we were hiding over there. Let's go faster, Max. Come on. They're over here, guys. They're walking here. Oh my gosh. Two of them. Faster, Max. Have you filmed them? Yeah, good job. Oh my gosh. And then happened a thing we couldn't expect. Come on, you know us. Yeah, Dima, we all know each other. When we were back to our shelter to pick our things, there was police waiting for us. We needed documents. Let's have a drink, maybe. Dima just realized who we were talking to. Turn the camera off, Dima. Well, guys, we're out of the zone. Officially. We were taken here by a police car. Well, we're in Dityatki right now. We've been to a secret place and now we are back. Look at it, guys, the main thing. We've got a pass to the zone. Or rather, it's not the real pass, it's a protocol. We were busted just because we were too loud. We didn't expect there were some patrols nearby. 
and they just heard us. When we were back, there were about 15 police officers. We didn't have chances to escape, and we had to surrender and sign the protocol. And that's it. There's a 30 bucks fine. No, it's about 15 bucks. That isn't a real fine. But we're thinking about going back to Chernobyl right now. Do you really mean that? Yeah, we don't have to walk far. Yeah, we're almost there. Maybe we'll better wait, guys. I think you don't expect to see us that soon. I know, they wait us all the time, day and night. The main thing is not shout again, be quiet. But now we can't be silent. Dima is gonna drink now. So oh, that is not the end, guys. We are going to the zone very soon. In search for the secret tunnel. Asus? Is it a storage facility for nuclear waste? I think so. Let's check it out. What kind of waste is inside? The liquid nuclear waste. Is it something new or, or that was from the NPP? I don't know for sure. We shall see. Is it spam fuel? Yeah. But that must be extremely radioactive, guys. Yeah, I told you already. And we've got a gas mask. Yeah, and the suit. But this can't be enough for protection, guys, don't you think so? That is quite enough for us, not for you. A fence? Well, let's climb it. Yeah, let's climb. Climb. Oh, there's barbed wire still. Yeah, see, there is some, and there is nothing. Will it stand us? Oh my gosh, it's shaking so hard. That is louder than I expected, guys. Easy enough, took me one sec. Just look at it, there is nothing inside. Yeah, it is darker through, we can't see what is inside. We only read about this place. There's supposed to be a nuclear waste storage and so on. But there are no proofs of that, no data. We can only imagine what can be inside, of this building. Maybe there will be remains of people. Yeah, of people try to get inside. Can we go there? Just look at it. Oh my gosh, what the hell is there? Is it the nuclear waste already? It beats me. Is it fluid here? Yeah. Oh my gosh, what the hell is that? What if this water is waste itself? I don't know. It's risky. What if this water is contaminated? It can be radioactive. The trouble is we don't have a dosimeter with us. Yeah, that's a big problem. We don't have an ocean if this water is okay. Or it's radioactive. Let's go and see if there is another way. We can be sure, but I wouldn't go through that water. What we've got there? Wind and lantern. Oh my gosh. Well, just let me get a... Are you ready, Max? I do, but I need to... Are you? Okay, I'm not ready. Well, let's go then. I see something. Oh my gosh, there are holes everywhere. We have to be careful. Oh my gosh. There are so many corridors here. There he is. So this is always forward. He's our Susanin. Oh my gosh, that's like in a video game. Just like in Stalker. I don't know, I haven't played that. Me too. And there's another stolen wall door. Watch out, don't fall down. Oh my, it is shaking hot. Yeah, it is very unstable. And there is some water below. Look down. There can be radiation here. It is very soft and keeps bending. See? Okay, let's get out of here, before we fall in the water. Hey, Sus, have you found some nuclear waste? We need to go upstairs now. Okay, let's go. I'm going back. It is the storage room. You mean with nuclear waste? Yeah. Was it right there? Yes. Oh my gosh, we've been inside. Each floor has three rooms, see? Yeah. Look there. Yeah, and be careful, Alex. No, I'm not going there. That is too risky. Yeah. What is there? Oh my gosh, such a big ventilation pipe. It might be filtrating some radionuclides. There are stairs. Another way. We have found another exit. There are plenty of trees. Damn it. That was hard to open, guys. So huge. What a deep sound. Oh, oh my gosh. The whitewash is falling down. The entire building started holding and shaking. Don't close it tightly, or we're gonna stay here forever. There are some Soviet lockers. For radioactive waste? They look so cool. Be careful there, guys. No, that's some electric stuff here. Ground wire. Three wires here. Let's see. Oh, there it is. Blinker is down. There is instruction about using that fuse box. But what was it for, guys? Any ideas? And what is a blinker? Oh my gosh, I've stayed here for one second. Suze is gone already. Are you there? There you are. 
I have almost lost you. There is plenty of dust. Do you feel that, Max? Yeah, sure. It may be radioactive. I am not sure about radiation, Alex, but it is dirty here, yeah. Nuclear waste storage facility is in poor condition, nothing else to say. Can people keep nuclear waste like this at all? I don't think so, but uh, we know nothing about it. And I wonder if those three rooms were a real storage place. And where could they take it? And these small chambers, left and right, were the places where people kept nuclear waste. In giant tanks. Me and Sus are going to check what's inside. These rooms are everywhere, and they are enormous. Holy prebate! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! I've got a drop on my head! Oh no, Max! Is it radioactive water? Probably yes, I don't know. Am I okay? Oh my gosh, where is this water from? It is pouring! Oh my, it's coming from there! Max, we're gonna go down, what do you say? We will see what is there. I think it may be dangerous. Because of water, it can be radioactive, guys. What if it's contaminated? Let's go there. That sound was getting on my nerves. Don't you feel the same? Yeah, a little. But I've got a little headache, you know? Maybe because I didn't sleep well, or because of huge radiation. Hush, everyone, we can be heard. We are very lucky, for now. No one has seen us. Oh, there's a power line. It is very close. Yeah, it is. Do you want to go there? Have you been there? Yeah. The echo is even worse there. Super Seuss has taken some cool tools, including rubber pants. He can walk through water. And some gas masks. But they won't help much. If there was much of heavy water, it could get in soil. And thus, radiation here may be dangerous. What is that, Seuss? Rubber gloves? Yeah, just in case. Three fingers to shoot. Oh, yeah, Soviet Union was smart. Now fishermen use it, but it isn't the initial purpose of the things. And what was the initial purpose? These suits were made especially for Chernobyl. Really? Yeah, for radiation protection. It's L1, light radiation protection suit. That's cool. Look, Max, it's a slipper. That is something new to me. And now, like this. Comfy enough? There must be some giant tanks with liquid nuclear waste somewhere. But someone has stolen them. Where could they put liquid waste then, if they were stealing tanks? Right below this video is these guys are crazy. They are nuts, psychos. Because for doing this, they must be brave or mad. Do you hear me like that? Connection check. <laughs> I can't see anything, guys, because the lens are fogged up. Guys, that is hard. They're gonna go down, in the very heart, in the very place where is supposed to be the radioactive waste. That is hard, Max. It is so hard to breathe in this mask. Let's go. Good luck out there, guys. I can't believe you do it. If your legs start melting, cry loud. And I'm gonna run from here faster than I can imagine. Go. Tell me the depth. Look how it breathes. Is it deep? He's inside. Go, Alex. That's a hell. Houses uses this mask all the time. Oh my, it's all scary. There's some water below. That's really dusty here, guys. And maybe this dust is radioactive as well. Bloody hell. Something is falling on me. It is radioactive. This suit is cool. It is well insulated. Now look at this round thing. That used to be the base of the tank with liquid nuclear waste. Why there is gravel below? I don't know. Max, stop shouting. Are we gonna become deaf soon? Look at this terrible dust, guys.
Do you breathe well? Yeah, it is so hard. Why could these tanks go, guys? And the waste? Something is dripping here. What is that, Sus? I don't know what is that. But it doesn't look dangerous anyway. It's a rain of nuclear waste. Is your seat okay? It is punctured. Really? It's okay, I knew it is punctured. That is a hell, I can't see anything in this gas mask. It is really hot, guys. I sweat really much, but I have a slight feeling that I am protected from radiation, guys, wearing this suit. And I feel protected from this heavy water as well. Gas masks, it is stupid. Who even invented them? That is so stupid. It is hard to breathe and sweat hard. Sus has taken off his mask, in a former nuclear waste storage, I have nothing to lose. But Max is even afraid to go there. He's upstairs, over there. He called us psychos. He said he's too young and will leave. The main thing not to move much, to throw less dust in the air. Well, now we know that radioactive waste has gone from this storage. There are no tanks and no waste. And we don't know where it is. And who could take it? Right, if you have an idea about where could radioactive waste and tanks go? Do you have any guesses, guys? Where could anyone get these tanks with nuclear waste? It is near Chernobyl power units. Guys, it is getting even more dangerous. Every second. Get up faster, please. Okay, let's go to the fifth power unit to see the flooded cellars. Hello, friends, I'm gonna take you to the crane. Just look at this huge crane. It can lift up to 700 tons, and we have decided to climb to the very top of it. Dima pretends to be a local walker. See his jacket. It's from a real nuclear power plant. So no one's gonna learn that he isn't... Oh, there's another emblem here. True thing. Yeah, guys. Since now I officially work here. And we're going to... Look at the fourth power unit. From above... From the crane. And we're gonna climb there. Was I looking drunk, Alex? We also need to attach this thing back to the crane. Just think about it. That building used to be a nuclear power plant office. Yeah, and be careful, police will come here in 10 minutes. Okay, let's go, yeah. Run, everyone. But Dima, that is the wrong way. That is 120 rail profile. Usual rails have 75 profile as the maximum. Just see the size. It was created with only one purpose. To deliver the nuclear reactor to the nuclear power plant. Yeah, just that. It is huge. And look at the wheel. One wheel weighs a ton, just imagine that. Do you like 120 rail profile? I have never seen such rails. Only 100 profile and 65 profile. They are used underground. But on 120, one wheel weighs a ton. And some insulation here. Yeah, see cool insulation here. Is it for 100 kilowatts? Or maybe 500? And these cables are supposed to raise the nuclear reactor, which weighs 700 tons. Just look at this cable, guys. Where is the pass here, Sus? Over there. This way? You've been through a cable shaft? Yeah. It's gonna be hot, guys. I'm sure about it. But why there is such insulation here? What for? Is it the way? Oh, there is a ladder, Alex. Oh my gosh, guys, just look at this mess. Are you going? Sure thing. And you? Sure thing. Look at this tree growing through a crane. It looks rotten. I don't think so. Looks reliable. That is a hell, guys. It's enormous. It freaks me out. It is breathtaking. <laughs> to be honest, guys, I'm afraid of heights. Are you excited? My heart is racing. Look here, it's Pripyat and the river. And what is there? It's a village. This damn thing is shaking hard. And look at this mounting, see? Alex, that is hard. It's all scary. Let's go higher. What? The top. Are you giving up, Max? I'm just afraid of heights, you know? I mean, really? Film the nuclear power plant on smartphone. Look, guys, it is very cold. Now I have to turn off the cam, because I need both hands to climb safely. Wait a sec. 
Just look at it. Oh my gosh. It isn't the very top, guys. Susa is over there. Friends, let's go up. Before it is dark, let's film that. Are you kidding? It's so high. Come on, don't be afraid. There's some building. It was under construction, yeah. There are so many lakes here, everywhere. That is so scary. Do you hear that sound from nuclear power plant? Look there. I hear roaring. We're going very carefully. Actually, this crane is made very well, welded perfectly. I see the builders were pros, all made to last. Driver's cab? Hey, Max. We can't just pass it. Are you going up? Sure thing. Why not? Everything's taken, stolen. Let's go then. I'm afraid. Really? Yeah, it freaks me out. It's shaking, be careful. How can they do it? Right below this video, guys. Our guy Dima has disappeared. There are no guides, guys. There is only me, Alex and Sus on the top. And they aren't afraid of heights at all. Sus is over there. Holy moly. Let's go faster. Sus is on the top already. Okay, let's go. How do you feel? Do you feel dizzy? Yeah, I feel dizzy. And my heart is jumping out. I'm becoming the most emotional now. I just look below and realize that there's... It'll be over. One wrong step and we are dead. We have to walk even higher now. Let's go, Max. <laughs> Many lakes here. This one called Plavni. Look there, guys. There's fish here. Be careful, guys. It can go aside and forward, so it moves in all directions. Oh, I see you've got where we are. Hush, Sus. Be quiet. Oh my gosh, there's a cabin. Look at this height. It's a void. What is there? And how does it smell? It smells Soviet Union. Really? Your coat looks like from Soviet times, you know? A tiny Stalin. Yeah. Did you know that all Soviet leaders were short? Really? Stalin was 160 centimeters, by the way. Or was he 2 meters high? There's a car going nearby. That is just what we needed. We can hear them, but we're gonna hide there for now. There it is. Can you see it? It is over there, in the bushes. I'm so afraid. We have to be careful, Alex. And what is up there? There is a broken ladder. Let's look at it if you want. We have to be very careful. And how high is it here? What do you think? About 100 meters, I think. Holy moly, it's like a TV tower. I'm not afraid of heights, but this rusty floor freaks me out. That is hot, guys. It's all scary. I don't know if I should... Max! Hey, Max, let's go here. You can hear me. And I can't shout. There is a car nearby. Speaking frankly, this is my first roofing experience. And I'm climbing on a crane, which could leave the nuclear reactor. And supposed to deliver it to the power unit. Let's go and see. Holy moly, it's so scary. Look at it. Oh my, they're climbing here. What are you doing? Oh my gosh. Look down there. I'm finally here, and Sus was much faster than me. Believe it or not, but we are at the top of the crane, and there is a lightning rod here. Calm down, Max. You scared me. Admire this incredible view. Look here, guys. It is a power unit which was under construction, and there's a hell of a height here. And there, look there, guys. It is a fourth power unit, the one which exploded. It is covered in protective shell, all around, and we are so close. It is dangerous, all rusty and rotten, and sometimes stolen. It is scary staying here, guys. Don't try it yourself. That's a hell. Look down, guys. It's all scary. We've made it, guys. We have overcome our fear. Me, Susan, Alex. We have climbed to the top. Not me. I just hit my knee and didn't go there, you know? We're on the ground, guys. And Sus has seen a light in the distance. We're not sure what it means. Maybe that's security. We can't stay here anymore. What happened? Look over there, Alex. See? There's security, maybe. Shall we go and see that or get out of here? Let's go over there, maybe. Okay, let's get out of here. Faster. Super Sus wanna show us his flashlight. Holy moly. Plenty of bats here. When this power unit was assembled, some steel was some blasted right here. It was clean here. Yeah, they removed radiation with sand. Mm -hmm. Using sandblasting? Yeah. 
we have found a big sand blasting machine. There came air, and there was air with sand, sand holes. Look, a Soviet computer! Where? Here. There are still some micro schemes here. Was it a calculator or something? That was a kind of computer. There are plenty of them. Yeah, and people still buy such things. They use these micro schemes to make clock. So many. Another one, it says NPP. I don't know what was this for, but we have found them near the NPP. We have found a working sink and cleaning our hands from radiation. Have you got some alpha? No. There's beta, gamma and alpha radiation. Beta and gamma don't stain the body. But if you get some alpha, it's gonna be killing you entire life. Let's use this cleaning agent. Get some more, Alex. It works pretty well, guys. There goes the reaction, so foam appeared. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have to be fast, or this thing's gonna eat my hands. Look at it, guys, there was a layer of rust, it's red. Yeah. Look what we've got here. Oh my, it's copper. Is it one kilogram? No, it isn't. It's only half. And how much is that? A few dollars. We are out of power unit. The fifth one. And look what we've got here, a crane. A Chernobyl construction truck. Look here, the other levers. There's electrics and so on. It's on place. Oh my goodness, it's so old. And there are normal wheels here. The mechanisms seem to be working as well. I wanna start it. Let's go. It is closed. Okay. There we go. Some warning. That is so old, guys, but... Everything inside looks well still. Holy moly! These sounds are scary. Sorry, I can't use my lantern for so long. Can you hear that? 